Welcome back to the AI Equation. This week we are covering the top questions that people have in regards to ChatGPT. And today we will be discussing some of the recent news surrounding ChatGPT. And at the very end of last week, uh, Sam Altman, the former CEO of OpenAI, was let go after he was appeared to be voted out by the board. And it will be interesting to see in what direction the company decides to go following his departure. It will also be interesting to see uh, whether he stays in the AI space, goes into a different field of tech, or something like that, as he has been really at the forefront of a lot of the AI innovations over the past eight years. So that will be interesting to see. Another piece of news that came out last week is OpenAI has paused new ChatGPT Plus subscriptions due to a surge of usage. Uh, OpenAI's ChatGPT Plus hit a roadblock as new subscriptions faced a temporary suspension due to an unexpected surge in use. There is a lot of demand recently after the OpenAI Dev Day brought about uh, GPTs and the introduction of Dolly 3. So there is a lot of demand out there for ChatGPT Plus right now. The surge has been so large that people are actually reselling their ChatGPT Plus subscriptions on platforms like eBay uh, to capitalize on the scarcity of these subscriptions. Recently also OpenAI debuted ChatGPT 4 Turbo, uh, which they brought about during the keynote at OpenAI Dev Day. This is the new cutting edge model made to be even more advanced than ChatGPT 4. And GPT-4 Turbo is uh, going to be very interesting to use as it is designed for text analysis, but also designed to be able to understand both text and images. So I'm sure there's going to be a lot of new features that you are going to be able to do with GPT-4 Turbo. And we are also highlighting the work of Noam Shazir, CEO and co-founder of Character.ai from Time's 100 Most Influential People in AI. Shazir, CEO and co-founder of Character.ai, is a key figure in AI. Co-authoring the influential 2017 research paper, Attention is All You Need, which introduced the transformer architecture fundamental to modern generative AI tools like GBT. Shazir's venture Character.ai, launched last fall, boasts 3.5 million users engaging daily with AI characters emulating real personalities. The platform, backed by a $150 million funding round, offers diverse interactions, but concerns have arisen about its potential misuse for explicit content, prompting the company to employ AI-powered moderation. Character.ai reflects Shazir's vision for universally accessible intelligence, akin to the early days of the internet. While praised for aiding users, especially in overcoming loneliness, the platform faces challenges in content moderation. Shazir acknowledges these concerns, but emphasizes the technology's positive impact and versatility. As AI continues to shape user interactions, Character.ai character represents a milestone in bringing AI to a broad audience while navigating the ethical considerations inherent to AI-driven conversations. Thanks for tuning in to AI Equation. If you enjoyed today's episode, please consider leaving us a review and sharing the show with your friends. Can't wait to bring you more AI insights next time.